Today we'd like to teach you how to dance the most simple dances. So you can use this for weddings, dance parties, social dancing. So this is our social section where you learn how to dance socially. So we're not gonna give you technique, just simply how to dance. Everybody can do it, it's super, super simple. It's gonna be a great way to start your dancing journey. Okay, so welcome to our social dance section. How to dance when you don't know anything. So imagine yourself in social situation where everybody dancing on the floor and maybe you're the person who is standing in the corner looking at the people dancing and having fun and wishing to do the same. So here we, we are here to help you to do that. So it's very, very simple. Let's start with the most simple dance. In our opinion, is the best way to start with the swing. Because like if you hear the band plays Frank Sinatra songs, those live orchestras, everything, all of that can be swing and you can dance with the partner. Actually invite some lady, hold her hand, dance. It's gonna be a great, great, great experience. But how to get started? So basically let's close your legs and now the most simple what you can do is to start moving your body and taking steps from side to side. So basically we step side with the left leg, we step side with the right leg. Step side with the left, right, left, right. And for now, just for now, we're gonna lift our legs so we can see more clearly that we're having those steps. And remember, this is what we're teaching you. It's not a technique, it's just social dancing. It's how to start, how to dance in the most simple way, how to get started. Very easy, so we're going left leg, right. So basically, what we're doing is a side, steps, side, step, side, step side step and as you notice we add just very little body sway just very little so it's much easier for us to change weight side 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 and you can play music and see that when any music play and if you basically just rocking your body from side to side that's already look like some sort of form of dance Okay, now we're gonna do exactly the same, but we're gonna count it a little bit. So we're gonna have counts. One, two, three, four. And again, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Side, 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 side. Let's do exactly the same from reverse angle. Let's do it. And so starting with the left leg. So basically we're just moving side and side. What else are we doing? As we're moving, we're changing our body weight. So we're stepping to the side and we change our body weight. We're not just tapping there, we step and changing body weight. Side, side, and have a little bit body sway, as much as you want. Just have fun with that. Let's put a little bit timing to it. One, two, three, four. One, two, have fun. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So you guys are doing great. If you can do this, trust me, you can dance. It's very, very easy. Let's go to next level. So as you notice, we're just stepping side to side and we may call it a rocking action. So basically like we are rocking from side to side and for exaggeration to make uh, it more obvious, we were lifting our leg and kind of stepping. You can do the same, just basically rocking from side to side. But for today, we wanna ask you to actually lift your leg and feel that step happening. So guess what? That's already 50% of your basic walk. So what are the next 50? We're gonna do a rock step backward. Rock step backward. So here we may call it rock step side because we're rocking side to side. Now we're gonna take our left leg for the guys and right leg for the ladies and we're gonna just go back. We're gonna go rock step. We're gonna just rocking back. Rock step. So we're going back from rocking our body. And don't worry, you can put your heel back or no heel back, it just doesn't matter. Just basically, the fact that you are rocking, that's already what we need. Rocking step, back and forth. Let's do exactly the same for reverse angles. And what we recommend for the guys is actually rock from the left leg back. For the ladies, rock from the right leg back. So ladies from the right, because ladies are always right and men are from the left because men is always left. <laughs> Let's do solo first and go and rock, step, rock, step, 
rock and we try not to do too much actions because it's today lesson is not about technique it's just about social social way of just make you moving in the social parties very good so now let's come back uh, let's combine rocking to the side with the rocking back and forth let's see what we're gonna get so we start from rocking to the side so we're going Rock into the side, rock into the side. And after we did two rocks from side to side, we're gonna do rock step back. Rock step back and front. And I go side, side, back, front. Side, side, back, front. Side, side, back, front. And now for the guys or leaders, you follow my version. For the followers or ladies, follow Christina version. And guess what? Let's do reverse angle. Okay, let's do it. So we're going from the side. We're going rock and side, side and rock step back. Rock, step, rock, step. Side, side, rock, step. Side, side, rock, step. Side, side, rock, step. Side, side, have fun. Very good. That's already, that's all we need to know. But now we're going to take it to next level. Let's put some counts to it. So let's count as we go inside, we're going to count one. As we're going to other side, we're going to say two. As we step back with our rock step, we're going to say three. As we're going forward, returning from our rock step, we're going to say four. So total how many? Four counts. So we're going to count one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Side, side, rock, step, side side rock step very very simple let's do it in reverse angle and here we go we always start to the side so we're rocking one two three four one two three four one two three four one two three four we want to remind you that we have our first step as we're going side on count one ladies follow christina uh, gentlemen or followers follow Oleg. Now, two, we rock into other side. Now, for the guys or follower uh, or leaders, you take your left leg back, you're going three and return four. So you're going uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Very, very good. Now, let's take it to next level. Now we're gonna count exactly the same count, one, two, three, four. But this time we're gonna count three, four a little bit faster. So we change a little bit speed. So basically we're gonna go one, two, and I'll go, I will count a little bit faster. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So on one, two, we have a side action step. On Two, we have a side step. On three, four, we have a rock step. Just we count it faster. Therefore, we will do it a little bit faster as well. Three, four. One, two, fast. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So what's the difference between the before version and this? That before we were counting all the same. One, two, three, four. For here we do exactly the same, just one small difference. We count a little bit, one, two, here we count the same, but here we count a little bit faster on rock step, three, four. Therefore, we may call it slow, slow, and now we say quick, quick. And if we say quick, we try to dance a little bit quicker. Slow, slow, quick, quick. Slow, slow, quick, quick. Have fun, slow, slow, quick, quick. Slow, slow, quick, quick. And if guys, this is too simple for you, you want to learn more technique and more in depth all our dancing programs, check my link here, dancewithorlik.com, become a member, and you learn a lot of amazing stuff. Let's keep going. Reverse angle. So we go with our new timing. So we're gonna side one, two, now we count a little bit faster. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one two, three, four, or we count slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, slow, quick, quick. Very, very good. 
Let's take it to next level. Now we're gonna try to dance it together. So just basically hold arms together. There is a many different hand holds. Close hand position, two hand hold, one hand, or it just can be in front of each other. In this case, I wanna have maybe two hand holds like this. Two hands, we're just gonna have two hands just to feel it easy and fun. And now as remember, guys or leaders, we're gonna go from the left leg to the side and then rock step left. Okay, let's do it. Remember our count. One, two, now faster. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And now guess what? We're already dancing swing. Let's do it this way. So you can see a little bit more clear. So we go side, side, rock step. Side, side, rock step. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And there will be no difference if I want to get to know lady more and have a little bit more closer proximity. So we can stay in this position. And our steps do not change. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. And for this step, trust me guys, you don't need any technique. This step itself, it's already a very, very good way to dance almost to any kind of music. Is it Frank Sinatra or any other orchestra play? Everything will fit in in this. This is a swing and it's very, very easy to do. Okay, so let's take it to the next level. What is the next level? Once we already did this, this we call single timing. So single timing, we go side, side, back, front. Now, if you add another level to it, we're gonna add a little bit tap. We call it double timing. So we're going side, tap, side, tap, rock, step. Side, tap, side, tap, rock, step side tap side tap rock step side tap side tap rock slap side tap side tap rock step so it's exactly the same if you feel this is a little bit difficult for you keep dancing your rock steps rocking actions and just get familiar with it but if you want to get a little bit better more have a little bit more fun you can add a little bit second second beat to it so you're going if you put counts to it we're gonna have one and two and three, four. One and two and three, four. One tap, two tap, three, four. Slow and slow and quick, quick, slow and slow and quick, quick. And guess what? Let's say you are dancing a single rhythm, just side to side rock step, and your partner doing double rhythm, it still will match music perfectly. Let's see how we can do it together. And going one, two, three, tap, three, four, one and two and three, four, one and two and three, four, one and two and three, four. Very, very good. Okay, knowing this, you can dance to any song, but how we can make it more fun? We can dance exactly the same step, but slightly to change a direction. So instead of facing the same way all the time, we can every step slightly, if we dance a single rhythm, slightly to take it around. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, or with the tap, one and two and three, four, one and two and three, four, one and two and three, four, one and two and three, four. So this is the first lesson from our super, super basic, super, super beginner, how to dance at the social events, social parties, weddings, whatever you want. Just follow this, and later on, we're gonna bring you more information, more fun steps, more very, very easy dances. Thank you for watching. Remember, subscribe to YouTube, and also check our programs, dancewithzolik.com, right here, for more information. And if you'd like to exercise and make six pack and strong body like Christina, check dance, fitmethod.com. Her program is really amazing and see you next time.